Hey guys, how's it going? So, I just got PS5 for all the new new PS5 owners. I'm brand new owner myself. So, if you're having trouble with your controller not updating, I learned that like when I first put this on, my controller would not update to save its life. It would say, if your controller's turned off, please turn it on. I would hit the button. All the buttons would work. Nothing would happen. Well, I had to take a little clip, put it in that little hole right there. And that resetted my controller. You have to hold it down for about four or five seconds, somewhere in there. And you'll have a notification pop up somewhere in here saying that your controller disconnected. But once you get on Modern Warfare 2, I noticed... When you're in the firing range, your active trigger does not work. So, do not let that fool you. Because, like, I raged out. I was about to send my PS5 back, even though I just got it home like an hour ago. But, if you actually get inside of a game, which will let it load up, it actually works for some reason. Now, I don't know why it does it or how, but if you're having problems getting your controller to, to update, I would definitely recommend hitting that reset first. But the way to do it, would be you'd have to go into your settings which is at the home page which i'll do another video on later but yeah that's how i got my controller to update but my main thing is talking about the active trigger where you got the wall of the trigger and it see like you got the wall then you got the shot it doesn't work on the firing range but if you're actually in a match it works so I just wanted to clear that up front. Hopefully this helps some of y'all out. If it does, please hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, share the video if you need to, do whatever. But hopefully that helps get your game back on track. Alright, well, y'all stay safe, keep slaying, y'all have a good one.